Ladies and gentlemen, I am sorry. When I was completing my two master degrees, the main problem that I faced was how to find an area of research in order to produce the dissertation for partial fulfillment that required to award master's degree. This is common for all students, those who involve postgraduate studies. To address this common issue that has been experienced by students who are new to academic research, I prepared a simple and self-explanatory PowerPoint video presentation for your easy understanding as research types and approaches. As we all aware, there are two main approaches towards research as quantitative and qualitative approach which can be used according to the research types. There are 10 research types as basic, correlational, descriptive, applied, experimental, an action, ethnographic, historical, exploratory, and explanatory. Anyhow, understanding the definition or meaning of these research types is important to select the area of research according to the extent that you can dedicate and spare your time for the research work. By going through the definitions, you can select best suited research area to write your research proposal accordingly. Let's see these definitions. Applied research used to solve a specific practical problem of an individual or group. This type of research is useful for developing new systems and procedures in specific areas. Basic research is being used to improve scientific theories. Correlational research, as indicates by the name itself, is being used to see whether there is a relationship or covariance between two or more variables under study. Descriptive research is important to describe characteristics of the selected population and it does not answer any questions. Experimental research is being used for various experiment related studies. Action research as proposed by the name itself is being used to take an action to address the existing burning issues and solve problems accordingly. Ethnographic research involves observing the subject being studied in their natural setting rather than artificial environment of a lab or focus group. Exploratory research is one of the prominent type that is used by most academic researchers where Researchers explore a hidden issue which is observable by any research areas. Explanatory research is used to explain the phenomena studied. Historical research is involved examining past events and making predictions for the future. Ladies and gentlemen, that's all just for now. Hope you understand the importance of selecting a research type. My next video will be about how to write a research proposal. Thank you and have a nice day.